Maps and modes have been updated, and now we have Clam Blitz as our ranked battle mode. What is Clam Blitz? If you ever played Calvin Ball, it's kind of like that. The rules kind of get made up as you go. That's just putting it lightly. Now, what Clam Blitz actually is, is you collect a bunch of these clams. They will form a football. You throw the football into a basketball, uh, or sorry, into a uh, one of those little punching bags that you, in, that you see in like a boxing gym. Uh, it breaks open, and you toss more clams into the basketball hoop. I'm not joking, this is what Clam Blitz is. Around the map there will be clams. We just gotta collect a bunch of them and then uh, start delivering them to uh, the hoop at the other end of the map. Uh, I don't remember exactly how many the how many clams you need in order to form a full um, a full blah 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 football. I think it's ten. I could be wrong, but it's been way too long since I played this. But this is probably one of my favorite uh, ranked modes in the game, uh, outside of uh, Splat Zones. It's super goofy. Okay. We broke their barrier. Hello. Aw, oh, there go with my clams. So anytime you get splatted, your clams on hand get uh, get knocked out, and you need to, you know, collect more of them. But if you splat somebody else, then yeah, they can uh, they can drop their clams. And I think they by default can drop a couple of clams, even if they don't have any on them. Uh, uh, I could be wrong about that too. But anyway, that guy has a football. Uh, if someone else were to pick it up now, then uh, they would pick up the football. There we go. Uh, looks like they've got two footballs on their team, actually. So now all they got to do is go to that little ball right there and throw the football. It pierces the ball, and then all they've got to do now is throw more clams into there. By default, breaking the barrier will um, net them uh, 20 points off of their total. And uh, their total, like, it goes down from... 100 to uh, 0. Whoever gets to 0 first is the winner. I've got 7 clams. Uh, not anymore. We're still in the lead, but barely. We've got a free football right there. Go away. And another one's down. Periodically, more clams will show up on the field. So if you're ever, you know, out of clams to pick up, some of them, some more of them rather, will uh, end up showing up eventually. All right, when you're ready, just toss the uh, football with the A button. Hello. Each clam seems to be worth three points, which is not bad. And I believe it also resets the timer left on the available um, clam basket every time you toss a new clam in there. Which is kind of neat. Looks like another one just got tossed in, which is cool. Uh, by my estimation, we need five more clams in to, uh, to win or just break open the barrier at all. I believe if one barrier is busted open, the other one cannot be broken open. So there's that to consider. There we go. You cannot pick up enemy footballs, by the way. Uh, where can I go here? Lay down some pressure on that slosher, I guess. There we go. There's some more. Uh, huh. I missed. But yeah, you can toss the football just to uh, just to get it out of the way. Thought I got one in, but I guess I missed. If uh, this game mode seems confusing, don't worry. I'm sure you're not alone in thinking that. Oh, man. I got a guy. Uh, 
Uh, okay. One of their footballs disintegrated. No, they didn't. Oh, it's in the process of it anyway. That's not good. We're still in the lead by a hefty margin, which is okay. They broke the bear. Oh, God! I didn't think there was someone right there. I guess they snuck into there uh, after the Booyah Bomb. Uh, barrier's closed, so yeah. Ten seconds left, and uh, if neither barrier is open, then that means it's our victory by default. Wouldn't have been a knockout, but... There we go. Not too shabby. Let's keep this train a-rolling. And we're here at Port Mackerel. Admittedly, not as fitting a stage for Clam Blitz as Gobi Arena, because, you know, that's more like a basketball arena, but hey. Alright, I gotta remember that this is not Turf War, and I should not focus on every little splotch of turf. However, I do want that special gauge up. Cool. Uh, let's cool. Cool. Got a lot of clams already. That ink rail is not normally there. That is... Oh, God. Um... Okay. I didn't think they already had our barrier breached, but sure. We've got 19 clams on our side. 22 now. Oh! Oh, Booyah Bomb went off. As in, like... They tried to use it, but uh, they got splatted in the meantime, so... Oops. Alright. They've got a football. Go. I haven't been picking up any clams whatsoever. Is that one of our clam uh, footballs down and available? Oh, give me that. It's a base 20 points if uh, you can get a football into the, the net there. They're just waiting for our barrier to, uh, yeah. Again, one barrier needs to be out in order for uh, the other barrier to be breached. Oh, no! Ooh, this ain't good. Ooh, this really ain't good. How? Oh, man. Two footballs ready to go. Oh god. Not bad. Oh. Oh. Also, whenever the barrier gets put back up, a free football spawns for whatever uh, team just, uh, you know. Oh, this is not good. 
Yeah, whatever team's uh, barrier gets uh, busted, a free football will spawn after it uh, gets, you know, reset. There we go. Oh, man. Mm, the whole team's down. They don't have a football, though. At least not yet. Burst bombed. A lot of their team. Oh man. Oh no. This might be game. All air has to do is get two more in. There we go. Yeah, I feel like I didn't contribute much at all for that map. Because I did not find any clams. No, oh, but uh, no cracks in the defeat bar, so... I'm cool with that. Are we going back to Port Mackerel? Nope, we're going back to... No, yeah, we are going back to Port Mackerel. <laughs> Oops. For a second there, I thought that, uh... That shot, like that opening shot, was gonna be of, uh, Gobi Arena, but guess not. Make a cleaner path there. Wow, pink is already over here. There's some, but uh, I missed my jump, so... How good is it actually? Um, if I keep failing my jumps like this, it's not actually that good. I've got so many clams, I don't want to lose them. Doesn't really help that uh, whenever you do have the football, your location is marked on the map for everybody to see. Oh no! It is also a valid strategy to, uh, to just throw out the the football just to, you know, pass it to your team. Like, you do not have to hold the, the ball the entire time. Oh, no! <laughs> They've got two footballs. And they're making their move. Oh, my God. All right. Oh, my Jesus. Now nah, they still broke the barrier. They're getting some free clams, too. Ooh, this is not good. Our football went to Putski. Get out of here. Oh man. Just resetting that timer. No one can uh, can get in there. Or whenever people did get in there, they got splatted immediately, so. Oh guys, come on. I'm out here trying to be clever. And they just win. That was some destruction, right there. 
I didn't do very well. I should not be blaming my team. Ow. 